got a lot of offensive. What would you like on that, especially after the Memphis game? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I thought we were more physical. Um, you know, we were, we were more locked in to start the game. I th- you could see the energy and commitment. Uh, the connectivity was there. And, uh, you know, held them in 25 or under the first three quarters. This was uh, really solid. When your team is locked in kind of defensively, they were able to work 15 steals. I think by the time the starters sat down, it was like 34 to 8 in points off turnovers. I mean, just how much does that kind of unlock the offense and make things so much easier? Yeah, I mean, for me, it's it's great when we can turn defense to offense. You know, we can be, um, you know, punishing in transition, but really it's just about getting stops. You know, that's the number one thing. So we don't have to force a lot of turnovers. Um, you know, it's more about that commitment, that physicality, and finishing possessions with rebounds. And, if, you know, if we happen to get steals on the night and can run out and score, that's a bonus. But really we're just looking for that commitment, and that physicality, and, and that purpose defensively. And I think when we do that, we're a different team. I thought there was a lot of force and purpose um, offensively. We didn't take things for granted. We made sharp cuts. We set good screens. We got into multiple actions. We played with pace. And uh, we obviously got some points off of uh, turnover. So, you know, you add it all up, we were able to score the ball. Steve, I'd ask you a couple I remember when it was, but early in the week, how you know you had to play off the team Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, really the last rest of the schedule. Just what did you like about the way they responded after Memphis mm-hmm. and going to tonight, given that? Yeah, I, I feel. Um you know, great about the way they responded. Memphis, I thought that the physicality wasn't there. Um, I feel like the the purpose wasn't there. I don't think we valued every single possession the way we did tonight. So tonight, we uh, they were extremely locked in and uh, played hard. You could see it from uh, the beginning. I thought Andre set a, a, a great tone for us with his physicality in the in the paint at both ends, and uh, everyone else's energy was was high as well. Speaking of him, I mean, I know you don't problem with point guard depth right now, but given the way he handled the ball on that, uh, that steal on dunk, do you see him uh, getting a look to the one? I'm going to pretend you never said that. <laughs> <laughs> with, uh, I mean, well, obviously Andre did what he did, but I mean, Nick's minutes weren't long, but is it fair to say they were huge? I mean, in the first part of the first quarter, the defense wasn't excellent. And mm-hmm. then when Nick came in that five minutes that he gave, you seemed to kind yeah. of shame I, I thought Nick was great. I don't think that's an indictment on Andre. I thought Andre was fantastic. But our team defense grew uh, after the first six minutes. Uh, so I think both uh, Andre and Nick were, were, were really good tonight, really had an impact at both ends, and uh, played with great energy and, and commitment. Was it good? I mean, your first night of a back-to-back, was it good to be able to rest uh, Kyrie? Yeah, and it's, uh, it's obviously a luxury. You know, it's better than uh, playing 40 minutes and going down to the wire. But uh, we're still... Um, got to do it again tomorrow. We'll get in at 3 in the morning and, and got to get ready to play tomorrow night. So, um, you know, there's no excuses. We, we'll take the uh, the few extra minutes we're able to rest, but uh, got to get up and uh, get our bodies going tomorrow evening. Is there any 